what's up y'all what's the family it's a girl renee from vivacious beauties and as you know the other beauty is in mississippi so in this video i will be setting up my christmas tree as well as decorating it i know i'm a little bit just a little bit late setting it up but that's all good you know better late than never so we good on that but i guess i will be decorating my christmas tree and talking about christmas you know I feel like Christmas and Thanksgiving are the moments where you should really sit down and just think, you know, like especially for Thanksgiving, like really think about what you're thankful for. And then Christmas is just a time for giving, you know, it doesn't have to be people that you even know. You can just give it to people who need something, you know, random person, just, it's just a beautiful holiday same same as um thanksgiving but yeah so i'm about to set this tree up and decorate it and i'm so so sorry for my energy my energy is probably like a negative three out of ten right now yeah and that's because i'm tired i'm sorry for saying that because i'm probably saying every almost everything but i'm a little sleepy i think it's mm, after 11 look at her still be here falling asleep standing up not standing up but Falling asleep, sitting up. You stupid. These things are heavy. I wasn't expecting it to be this heavy, but it's heavy. I almost fell a couple times, but let me get back to it.
right, y'all, we're getting to the end of me setting up this tree. No, I'm not done. <laughs> but what happened was my camera just stopped recording out of nowhere and I continued to check it throughout this video and everything was fine, of course, until a few minutes later when it just stopped recording. So I lost the rest of my footage, but no worries. I have a small little clip of my finished product and you will see it in three, two, one. Alright y'all, so that's about it for the tree. We actually had an angel to go on top of the tree, but I don't know. I think it broke. I think it broke a long time ago. And then we didn't get it replaced, but that's about it for the decorations. I want to know some of y'all's traditions that y'all do for Christmas. Do you guys set up the tree as a family or do you do it by yourself? Do you even set up a tree? You know, just want to know. See. And then I have this trouble of not putting, not taking down the tree when Christmas is over. I don't know why. I don't know why I go through that phase, but I'm just like, when the tree comes out and there's all these decorations, it just brings about good vibes and happy vibes and just good stuff. <laughs> like, I just want to keep it. I don't think I've ever been the type to like, you know, set out cookies or anything like that or even bake like, Christmas cookies, you know, like the Christmas tree or the snowman, stuff like that. I don't think I've ever been the type to, to, I don't think I've ever been the type to do that. But I would say the thing that I always want to happen <laughs> is waking up early, not super, super early, but early in our pajamas, coming downstairs or whatever. After we brush our teeth, of course, because nobody wants stank breath on Christmas. Nobody wants to open presents and smell that, that, ugh, you know? So, um, yeah, come downstairs with our pajamas and just start opening up gifts. That's, that's just what we do. That's what I like to do. I know some people open presents at night time. I feel like that would be cool, too. You know, the anticipation will build up until nighttime comes and then boom, boom, boom. <laughs> What's your favorite thing about Christmas? My favorite thing is being able to give gifts to people. I'm gonna say people in general because I like to give gifts to random people, people I don't know. For example, I donate money to, I don't even remember what it's called, but it's like a family in need, something like that. So for example, it would be like a mom and her two kids um, or three, however many kids she has. And I'll just donate money to that family or I would go out and buy stuff for the little boy, the little girl, you know, the mom, whoever needs it. That's what I would usually do. This year is going to be a little different because of COVID. So what's going to happen is I'm just going to donate money instead of just, you know, going out and buying gifts, which I think going out and buying gifts is like the best part too, besides giving the gift to the person and when they open it they have a big old smile on the face I think that's the best part the first thing that I love about Christmas is that part for sure and then the second thing would be buying the gifts and then the third thing of course would be just spending time with family so buying gifts being able to provide something for someone who doesn't have something that they you know wanted or needed and then just spending time with family just that that would make my Christmas I don't need anything honestly I really don't but just those things family especially I don't know what I do with these folks that I call my family I don't know what I do without them but yeah guys that about wraps up this video yes please 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 leave some comments in the comment section describing some traditions that y'all do some fire traditions because I know it's gonna be fire it's gonna be fun um What's your favorite part about Christmas? Just, just drop drop something in that comment section. It's all good vibes, okay? All right, y'all. I hope y'all have a merry, merry, merry Christmas, even though I'm still gonna see y'all before Christmas. But you know. Happy holidays, everyone. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Ava, say bye. Oh, there you go. Bye. No, okay, she's tired too. Okay, bye guys.